A nonprofit organization dedicated to the service and development of young women will close its Johnson City location this week. Thanks for joining us. I'm Sarah Diamond. Casey Marler is on assignment. The Board of Directors for Girls Inc. of Johnson City, Washington County issued a release on Friday announcing the facility would close effective July 26th. The nonprofit extended thanks to supporters, volunteers, donors, and staff who committed time to Girls Inc. News Channel 11's Karen Jenkins has more on what it means for parents and students in Johnson City. At this time, a spokesperson from Girls Inc. told me they have no additional comments about the sudden closure, but parents say they're now scrambling to find after school care just weeks before the school year begins. Girls Inc. has been a staple in the Johnson City community for decades, providing not just child care, but mentorship, empowerment, and education for young women. But next week, it will close, and parents who use the nonprofit are heartbroken. We're, we're devastated. We're shocked. This is a, a significant loss for our community. Katie Kelly's daughter Hagen goes to the after school program at Girls Inc. Kelly says she and other parents are now left scrambling to find an alternative. Everybody just got a week's notice, so a lot of people are out there trying to find that after school care, um, and it's, it's a little difficult. <laughs> Hagen will now go to the after school care program through Johnson City Schools called EduCare. EduCare is available at all Johnson City Schools. The service is there to specifically help working parents. So to have the flexibility of being able to use the morning EduCare to drop off early or that afternoon EduCare to where maybe you don't get off work until 5 o'clock or it may be 530 to know that your child is still safe at school, surrounded by friends, surrounded by staff that will love them and care for them. I think it's um, definitely gives peace of mind for parents. But Kelly says in addition to losing the programming specifically aimed at girls at Girls Inc, EduCare is also more expensive. So one month of um, Girls Inc is equivalent to one week at EduCare for us. Other low cost options for after school care include the Boys and Girls Club and Coalition for Kids. Representatives from both those programs say spots are still available. The last day for Girls Inc. is July 26th. If you're still in that position looking for after school care, we will have a list of options on our website at WJHL.com. Reporting in Johnson City, I'm Karen Jenkins, News Channel 11. News